What up guys, man is Reviewing Reviews here once again and today I'm going to be doing a review of the FU Skyline mod M6 right there alright so this is your packaging when it has red I'm going to do I have the red version and this is made by Americlone the FU and the side says FU mod and then the same thing right here and right here it comes with the competition clone mod and they make the FU hat and the Apollo and the M6 alright when you get it there's the FU sign right there and the USA flag right there okay when you get it you open it like this and there's your mod you take it out like this gonna be wrapped in this little plastic bag and here's the M6 and uh, you get, as you guys can tell it has the FU right there and it has FU right there at the bottom too the stars and the weird design it has the Americlone with the Mickey Mouse middle finger and my serial number is 943 really small right there there you go um, this body is made out of aluminum and it's covered, it coated in red with the copper button oh one thing I want to show you guys, look at this shirt Vapor District so if you guys are in the city of Placentia, make sure to take, check out Vapor District. That was my first vape shop that I went to. And look at the bag. Back. Vapor District. Yeah, that was the first shop that I went to. Um, great customer service. Hold on, let me pause the TV. Anyways, great customer service. And overall, it's a really good shop. Alright, let's take a look at it. Let me take it apart. There you go. Here's the tube. It's an only 18650 tube. There's no other tubing to it. Um, there's the threads right there. And the threads on this side. It's a weird shape mod. It's like the shape weight. <laughs> Alright, so that's the tube. It has teardrops and like dimples right there. It has the FU logo right there. It's engraved. All the logos are engraved, so they won't wear off. Here's the top cap. Look how small the top cap is. So when you get it, you have this Delrin insulator right there that you could adjust. It's really hard to adjust. Okay. And there you go. You then you get your Addy, I have the tow version 2.5. And screw it on like that. Oh, one more thing, let me show you. And this, it comes with a little bag. The little bag's right there inside. But you get extra copper pins. This is the smallest, medium. And I have the large one in here. Okay, so you get you push this up like that, where the threads are facing up, and then you get your top cap, fit it on there, and then you start screwing it on. You see how the silver pins, I mean the copper pins, not sticking out. You keep on screwing it until the Delrin makes contact with your atomizer. And the the copper pin starting to show because the copper pin is already making contact with your Addy okay there you go so that's gonna that's how it's gonna look with the longest copper pin let me put the rest of it back in here the packaging is pretty nice I like it okay so the magnet here it's the switch um, it is made out of magnets. Okay. 
Here's the switch, copper switch, and here's the infamous or famous magnets that the Manhattan has and all that. You have battery venting right there, as you can see some light going through there. And basically it's the same switch as the Manhattan. And I just got this stuck. God damn it. Hold on. Alright, so I got the magnets back together and I put it all back together. Um it's a not it's not a twenty two millimeter device. Because as you can see right there, my toe is a 22mm device, and you can see right there the mod's sticking out a little bit. But, I mean, some people out there might really bug them, but it doesn't really bug me because it looks sick ass tits on this toe, which I don't really care. And yeah, so, anyways, here it is as copper contact, so you'll get good conductivity, it's made out of aluminum the threads are not coated in red so that decreases the voltage drop let me drip um, yeah I'm dripping some ripe vapes, monkey snack really good flavor peanut butter and banana if you guys are wondering um, but yeah you guys should check out ripe vapes they have pretty good flavors they have VCT which is one of my favorites too um, vanilla tobacco They also have Key Lime Cookie, which is their famous juice right now. And that's pretty good, too. I have that right now in the BCT. And there's not really much to talk about. I mean, it's the authentic Skyline speaks for itself. So why would the clone not speak for itself? It's a replica. They didn't take the logo. They didn't copy the button they just took the design I mean and that's what we should see more of I mean yeah China should come up with their own authentic mods but like it's not plagiarism they didn't take the logo or anything I mean the design anybody could came up with it many mods the Caravella looks exactly like the turtle ship um but yeah guys I mean it's a pretty nice mod I got it for 25 bucks 25 bucks for a clone. Can you go any lower than that other than wholesale? I guess not. But don't count me on the price because not many shops will sell it for 25. I've actually seen some shops go for $45 for an Amara Vape clone. One time, I, one, oh my Jesus Christ, one time I saw Amara clone vapes clones go for a hundred bucks. Who's gonna pay a hundred bucks for a clone? I'm not. I'd rather might as well just buy an authentic mod if it's a hundred bucks. The only really authentic mod I have right now is the IPv3 which I gotta do a review on that too. Um, I also have the simple mod clone from I don't really know who makes it but that should be coming up soon. Uh, I'll be reviewing the newer version of the Tope. I already did a review of the Tope version 2. So if you guys want to see that, go to my channel and look at my videos. Um, but yeah, this will be... I'll do, also be doing a comparison if I could get a hole... Or if I could find screws for my Tope so that it gives it a fair chance. Um, but yeah, if I stock up on more... I'm, I'm going to try to save the juice. Probably like right there. And do the review of three of Bright Babe's flavors. So, we'll see if that happens. Um, but yeah, guys, that's really it. Is. I mean, it comes with nice packaging. No Amara Babe cloning or anything. Uh, nice looking mod. Feels great in your hands. Nice copper button. It's every... Time. I press it anywhere and it hits. Look, pressing side, that side, this side, that side. It has a really nice throw. The only con that I could find is it's not a 22 millimeter device. That might bug some people. Um, sorry, my ad is dripping. Um, 
yeah, the only con I could find is it's not a 22 millimeter device. Uh, it, sorry guys, it hits hard. Um, the pros comes in different colors. If you like blue, you could get a blue version. If you like pink, you could get a pink version. Red version, like I like the red. Um, but yeah, it looks nice with almost any Eddie throw on it. On it. Um, comes in copper too, silver plated, all silver plated, all gold plated, stainless steel. But yeah, I mean, if you like color mods, the FU Hattons, the simple mod, I mean, not the simple mods, the Skyline and the Apollo mods, they all come in different colors, so. Yes, I would recommend this. I did get it for myself since I liked it. But yeah, that's basically it. I mean, subscribe to my channel if you guys want. I will be posting videos like I said or later on. And that's it. Hope you guys liked the video. Hope you guys liked the intro. And vape on, my friends. Manny's out.